Alright guys, so in this video, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do the dolphin dive cancel. I think that's what it's called. I've learned this from a friend. And I have heard that a lot of CDL players or a lot of good players already know about this. I guess I was kind of late. Just figured it out like four days ago when somebody taught me. But you can actually dolphin dive faster in order to run faster. Maybe you want to pick up from the ground a lot faster and be able to fight people there's a faster way to dolphin dive in this game and that has helped my movement a lot even though it's a super small detail and you still you get only a little bit more movement than you usually do that adds up over time and you can just be uh, a more aggressive and moving player all the time if you're doing it so the funny thing is too it's exactly how it would be in modern warfare 2019 right where you're slide canceling you're pressing crouch crouch jump and in this game since i'm on the inverted feature where i press the crouch button once in order to dive it's crouch crouch jump it's the same exact thing so right here i'm gonna do the thing where if i'm dolphin diving without pressing crouch crouch jump maybe i'm just pressing crouch jump or crouch and then spamming the sprint button it would kind of be like this like this is kind of how it would look if i was doing without the slide thing without the slide uh or without the dive cancel and it still looks pretty fast it, it looks pretty fast and if i wanted to shoot off it it would probably be this where i'd have to like bounce up and shoot that's the delay on it now if i do the crouch crouch jump where i'm just like crouch crouch jump you actually get a little bit more of the movement faster and being able to pull up your gun faster being that you're pressing the crouch again so it would it would kind of be like this if i'm crouch if i'm doing the crouch crouch jump crouch crouch jump and you press crouch as soon as you touch the ground. So crouch, crouch, and then you can jump. And you can even see right there, like I immediately get up from the ground. Whereas if I wasn't doing it like this, I'm, I'm on the ground more and it doesn't bounce me right up. So if I'm not doing it, for me to bounce up all the way, I have to press sprint from here. Whereas here, if I do it and then crouch real quick, I immediately get up just like that. So if you're just looking at this video very broad it does look like i'm doing the exact same thing but if you try it in game and do it multiple times then you will know you will notice a difference of you doing it over and over and again like i said with the other dolphin dive feature right i like to do it sideways so when i'm doing the dolphin dive sideways when i'm just moving around the map like this to be able to dodge sniper bullets maybe get a little bit of extra movement left and right that is going to allow me to get up immediately as soon as i dive from here so if I was to dive over here and shoot somebody over there, it would look like this. Whereas if I didn't do it and did the dive cancel, it would just be like this. So super small uh, time where you actually get reduced speed, but it does make a di big difference, at least for me. And I am able to run around the Warzone map a lot easier while doing this. Now in my other video, I kind of wanted to clear some things up about the slide cancel because that video has gotten a lot of views and I have got that off somebody and there's a lot of negative comments on it. I know there's always going to be negative comments being that it's a highly viewed video and I'm getting a lot of people who aren't usually on the channel so they have their opinions. But there's a lot of people saying that one, it doesn't work or two, it's just going to be useless. So no, it has not been patched. I could do it right here or wait, my game glitched a little bit. Hold up. I could do it right here. So there it goes. Slide cancel. Slide cancel right there. So it does work still. I think that if you guys, um, if you guys are just having trouble with it, you're just not doing it right. And you can keep practicing different ways on how to activate it. But I don't think that this will be patched being that it is not as effective as most people think. So yes, when people are saying, oh, the side cancel is not even that good. So you're just wasting your time or you're trying to do something that doesn't work. It still works. It's just a lot more situational in this game than the other game. And I have talked about that in this video. That's probably why, too, when you see my gameplays, I barely do it at all, if I ever do it. Uh, the main reason I said to do it is, like, if I'm jumping over here, I could side cancel right there and then back up. And that would allow me to get another move in order to break cameras or to peek something. So side over here. Maybe I'll show my body a little bit, like, at the end of my side here. And then I can jump all the way over here. So it's, like, side cancel and then jump over. So doing stuff like that, there's... There's still multiple ways to do it. It's not completely useless, but it does have a lot less use than the other game, mainly because you can't slide whenever you want to. Here, I can slide all the way out here, but I can't cancel at all. 
but if I do the slide cancel, I have to jump first and then slide cancel super fast and then I have to pop all the way back. So it is a curve, it is a learning curve and you can only use it in certain situations. Most of the time, I am not gonna use this as I was talking about in the video today, the dolphin dive cancel, I use that all the time over and over because I believe that it's better to use that all the time than to just use regular dolphin dives. But yes, the slide cancel, it does have a ton of situations where it could be completely useless and also some situations, probably a lot less situations where you can actually use it. But also for the people who care a lot about having fun with the movement and stuff like that, this is an amazing feature for them as well. So I wouldn't go too crazy on it if you were if you are really striving to be better at this game it's not something that you have to master and something that's going to be super useful in every situation so yes i understand what a lot of people are saying by it's not great in this game or they feel like i'm just te teaching something that could be a waste of time i am saying that that is optional you don't have to learn that to be good at this game but it is some cool thing that we have found that could play some use in this game so that's just i wanted to say that out right there because i don't want to you know talk about the side cancel and say oh guys i'm gonna do the side cancel all the time because it's a new way that's broken modern warfare it's fun it has some uses but you do not need that at all to be a high level player to be top tier you don't need the side canceling at all it's just a great new addition to the game that somebody has figured out and it is fun to use sometimes it has some situations it could be used on and with that being said too i did talk about in that video right you could do a slide cancel fast like this and then dolphin dive cancel and you can mix it up too me just for simplicity i think i would rather just do the dolphin diving over and over in warzone in my past videos too when i first started playing i do mention that like sometimes i uh look left and right like this tax sprint then i can look left and right and tax sprint I do that still as well. I am not completely throwing that away. So let's just say this uh, open, maybe this open space right here, right? I could just dolphin dive over here, but maybe there's people around. Maybe there's like one guy left on the team that I kind of want to kill. So if I'm checking periodically, because I don't know where people are at like this and I see him, I can easily shoot him right here. Whereas if I'm just dolphin diving all the time, maybe I can dolphin dive right here and he's close enough to where he can kill me and I can't get into cover in time. So my new movement strategy for moving around warzone 2 instead of just slide cancel dolphin diving everywhere uh, like i was kind of talking about earlier it's mainly just dolphin dives and then doing that thing where i'm looking around a little bit running looking around i can dolphin dive cancel over here and then the momentum and everything is good too because i'm shifting my momentum like you can see right here i'm just like, dragging my body across the screen at certain times to be able to boost me forward so this space right here right I'm gonna dolphin dive cancel because I can just throw my body over here and avoid being shot. But then maybe, maybe when I come around here, I can do where I check like this because there's multiple spots. Dive over here, dive over here, and then I can keep checking multiple spots like this. I do the crouch spamming a lot in this game just to make me more mobile. And it does reset your attack sprint because you're more of a in a walking motion instead of being an attack sprint motion. So for like the new movement system, as far as the dolphin dive canceling and the slide canceling, that's kind of my opinion, my overall thoughts about that. And I just wanted to clear some things up and show you the new strategy that I have for running around the map. Under any video or live stream I do, I should have my link tree available so you guys could be able to check out all the other socials that I have right here. And then also my coaching services that I offer and if you join the discord below you can be a part of our amazing community and where we try to help others get better each and every day and then there's just other people that you can go connect with and play with other great players if you are having trouble finding players on your own so this is our sense community discord the main thing that i am most active on and all my other socials are listed in this link tree